Hello everyone and welcome to Gamey FTL. My name is Josh and I am joined by Lexi. Hi! We are going to play Her Story. It's a murder mystery in which we got this far, which is searching some stuff. But most of what we played is Othello. Let's watch the first introductory clip. And everything in this game is basically clips of this one actress, or little suspect, yeah. being interviewed. Murder suspect. You think it's murder? I mean, clearly it's murder. What can I do to help? She's a suspect already. Do you not do you not trust her? I really don't trust her. It could be because she's wearing orange though. Orange is supposed to make you very untrustworthy. How about blue? Blue is supposed to be good, it's calming. Okay. Let's see how calming this is. Yeah. That's me. But February and that was months ago. What's that got to do with Simon's murder? So he okay. was called Simon! Uh we can tag each video clip with our own tags with our own tags as well as the fact that the clip is tagged with i think the transcript as well as its own tags yeah but none of them are splued we found none. that out earlier <laughs> none of them disappointing really uh okay february that's not how you spell february february I think. I like the fact that it's got that kind Levio of... Saw. <laughs> Levio Saw. Um, that kind of IBM keyboard sound effect, the clicky clacky in the background. That's really cool. Oh, was that... Oh, yeah, you changed your keyboard. I thought you were using your clicky clacky keyboard. No, I because... I just thought that was normal. No, that's on the game. Oh, that's quite nice. Yeah. There's also, like, an aircon hum, which is um, mildly unpleasant. As well as the... Uh, Dusty screen. <laughs> Dusty screen and, and blurry glow of what I assume is strip lights. Yeah, the one on the left flickers. I didn't murder Simon. You've got it wrong. You've got the wrong person. I don't believe you. I really don't trust her. <laughs> uh, denial. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sure. Next one. I'd like to speak to a lawyer now. Untrustworthy smile. Please. You have no murder weapon. You have nothing. And all these stories we've been telling each other. Just that. Stories. She's a bit of a flirt. Is she flirting? That I mean, seemed a bit flat. All those stories we've been telling each other. <laughs> murder, murder, murder. <laughs> um, so, I don't think we'll need that one. I it's want just my liar! Stories. Uh, let's tag this one with... Although, I guess it's probably already tagged with stories, isn't it? Well, it's, yeah, but that's her... Um, Duda. Yeah. Transcript thing, yeah, sure, whatever. Oh! She says the word stories a lot. She happens to be an award-winning children's author. <laughs> Probably. Oh, see, now I trust her more than I did before. Okay. So, hang on. This one is the 3rd, the 7th, 94. Wow, 90s. She definitely doesn't look like she's from the 90s. There's and this one's a month very prior. Very post millennium haircut. Oh, no, not a month prior. But it is from the month yeah, before. Yeah, from June. June. Yeah. And this all happened in February. Yeah. Right. Which is. That's a quite a long time after the question, isn't it? Isn't it? Um, maybe. I guess investigations take a while. Let's go yeah, left to right. I don't know who she is to Simon. Mm -hmm. I don't even know her name. Access limited to first five entries. Why? Because there's eight of them and the, <laughs> the got no scroll bar. Bigger. Can we not click and drag? Ooh. Can we not click and drag the size of the box? No, this is 1994. We're lucky we've got a computer. <laughs> Windows 98 hasn't revolutionised everything yet. 
That's the thing I noticed actually. I watched True Detective and I was looking there like there's a scene in the office and I was like, their desks look really weird. It's because it's set in the 90s. They've got no computers. Uh, so we're damn lucky we got all of this. Yeah, I think I think she did it. I think she did it. I don't even know what she did yet. It's okay. Sounds weird. I'm not great at making up stories. She's shaved the sides of her head, or is that just pulled back hair? No, she's just got a ponytail, mate. I don't, I don't get what the use of this particular clip is. Next. <laughs> yes, I read a lot as a child and watched lots of TV. Then the doll's house we had, we still have in the attic. It's kind of a fairy castle. We used to play up there and make up our own stories. So was that related to the stories she was on about last time? Because this is... Oh, I don't know. I d that doesn't sound related to the stories she was on about. She was, she Who's was, we? She was... Is we her and Simon? Possibly. Or maybe she knows the person interviewing her. They don't allow that. That's conflict of interest. Probably. Let's see what happened in July. Fairy tales. Stories about lost princesses, evil witches, magical mirrors, and lost children. So you see, even before I knew the truth, I'd found it in those stories. Uh, she's crazy. Maybe not. Maybe something bad happened to you. Maybe there's magic maybe, in the game. Maybe something bad happened in their family, and it all kind of came out in these stories that they told each other. Oh, that's And they that's masked what... it. Oh, so like they used... They Prince... used the stories as a coping mechanism. Yeah, so Cinderella wasn't actually Cinderella. It was her or something like that. Yeah, that what you're saying? and her stepmom cool. like, made her work or whatever. That's what happens to Cinders, right? I don't know which one that was, but yeah, sure. <laughs> Next. No, it was just me and her. It was the name they were going to call their first child. They talked about it and were going to try when it came back. Florence's family had a history of first-born girls, so they were convinced it was going to be a girl. It's hard to know if this is all true. These are stories I remember that I read when I was a child. Maybe I misread, maybe I misunderstood. Or Sometimes it's hard to remember what happened last week. Hmm. I'm warming to her. Yeah, yeah? I'm not saying she didn't do it, but I don't feel like she did it out of just like, he said I look fat so I killed him. <laughs> Which was kind of the impression she, I was getting before. She seems like she's, um, oh, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is, but basically a little forgetful, perhaps. Yeah. Not particularly reliable. A bit ditzy. I didn't want to bit say air -headed. ditzy, but or air. Not very intelligent. But, yeah. Maybe. She has a thing for cups, though. I'm not sure if that thing for cups as much is that she has a drink. I have hey, a drink. Also. We've got very little to go on here. <laughs> Maybe we should organise all the clips by whether they've got cups or glasses in them. Because I remember last month she was into glasses and pictures and. I think in June they hadn't accused her yet. It was just the investigation. Uh, and that's why when she's wearing the white shirt in July, she asks for her lawyer. Yeah. It's because then she's so been they... arrested. Okay. that's That makes some sense. See, all this watching of crime dramas is really helping out now. <laughs> this is all new to me, which is probably a good thing because I don't watch many crime dramas. I don't like them. I don't think but this, this is cool. Uh, next. I'm not sure where the dollhouse came from. I don't know if it was given to them or they inherited it. I mean, they wouldn't have had the money to buy it. It was so huge. <laughs> it must have been taken up to the attic in parts and then reassembled up there. That is a beautiful thing. Wallpaper to scale little furniture, the lights work, mirrors, beds, 
could do these and pillows. Maybe she used we spent it. hours and hours playing it. We invented all these characters and families who lived there. We wrote paperwork for them all. Passports, diaries, we gave them all really elaborate stories. Once a moth got trapped in there, we'd left a light on. It was making the most horrendous noise. We tried to kill it, but it was tough. We ended up crushing it under a copy of the Arabian Nights. So she's an insect killer. She's a liar because moths are not hard to kill. Have you ever tried to humanely catch a moth and like give, push it out the window? You'll yeah. kill it. Yeah. <laughs> Either that or she was just she's just a bit sadistic. She said it was tough. Because I remember was it in like oh what's the Hannibal film? Uh Silence Dra of the Lambs? No, dra dragon something? Red dragon. Red dragon. I remember someone saying, if you're a crazy person, you like to kill bugs when you're little. Oh, okay. But it was just one moth. I think that's more of a pathological thing. Right, okay. We don't know, she might have been at it all the time. Could have been. She, she knew the Arabian Nights was effective. Indeed. How do we get access to the other three? Do we Click search and drag? again, maybe? Stories. No. Stories no. two. Oh. You just put in the, the word space two. Stories two. No, maybe not. <laughs> mm. uh, I think maybe we have to refine our search to more things about stories. Okay, so dollhouse? Do we want to learn about this dollhouse? It doesn't particularly seem... I don't understand its relevance. No, it know. seems like like a metaphor or an allegory or something for her. Maybe she just imagined the real house as a doll's house, and that's why she killed everyone. <laughs> Not very good motive. <laughs> <laughs> I have this no, dollhouse, they, they wouldn't... so it killed everyone. And stuffed them and posed them like real dolls. Maybe she just wanted she everyone to. She only killed one person. Or well, she only allegedly killed one person. Mm. Uh, oh, can you what? hear those lights? Yeah. That is effective but irritating. <laughs> it's definitely a workplace in the 90s. Yes. Okay. What keywords are we after next? We could look for Doll's house, we could try and find its relevance. Okay. Okay, because there's a new one, there's a blue one that we've not seen. Uh, we have seen her in blue, remember? No, that we haven't like... seen that one. Because the other ones with the eyes are ones we haven't looked at yet. Yeah, yeah. But uh, we have seen her so from when's this? the 25th. So this is before the orange. <laughs> so it goes blue, orange, white. Blue, orange, red. Because yes. otherwise, I'm I can only do it by shirt color. Can we can we categorize these by shirt color? Wait, Could no. She, we should probably just do it by month or date. Twenty fifth of June. Twenty fifth of June. I reckon that... they're probably all going to be ninety four, so we'll probably be all right. Yeah. Anyway. Yes. I inherited it from my parents, so it made sense to move back, me and Simon. Felt like going back to old ways, before the pregnancy. It reminded me of being a girl, a dollhouse in the attic, old things. We didn't sleep in my parents' bedroom for a long time. We decorated it as soon as we moved in, but it was another year before we started sleeping there. Mm. So her parents are dead and Simon's her partner. Yeah. Right. And the doll's house is a big thing for her. Maybe she killed her parents as well and she felt too guilty to sleep in their bed for like a year and then she got over it. I feel like we're extrapolating a little bit. <laughs> I never said I was a good detective, I'm just good at watching detective dramas. That's fine. So at least we've got another keyword. We've got um, 
pregnancy. Yes. Can... She was talking about children before and I was very confused. When was she talking about children? Florence! And they were going to have another one and they knew oh, it was going to be Eve. a girl. Oh, Eve. I thought she was talking about someone else. Yeah, but she said we were trying or something about that they were going to try when they got home. Right. Okay, so... It was... The, na the name Eve was what she was going to call I think it's what, her kid. Or remember what their friends called their kid, because it was in the family. Maybe Florence is related right. to them somehow, like it's Simon's sister or something. Okay, so we've got Florence, Eve, pregnancy, dollhouse. Yeah. A freaking dollhouse. All house, related. Man. This dollhouse seems like a... I'm not sure if it's a red herring or it's actually really important. It's probably important, but it doesn't seem the most interesting or pertinent. No, I'm, I'm more interested really to figure out who the hell everybody is. <laughs> okay, should we start searching um, for other people? Remember we can like store clips if we need to. Yeah, but... so we look at the rest of these ones while we've got them. Fine. I feel like Simon Cowell every time I do this, except the same shit contestant keeps on coming back. This isn't really much of a talent. I don't know, she's got the cup thing going on. No, because she's not doing that weird cup thing that's really trendy now. Oh, what, the cup stacking? No, not that, it's the one that people use, it's a percussive instrument, and you knock it on the corners and spin it and stuff. And... But that's not new, that was... That would that would have been a nineties thing. I remember that from the nineties. I know, but like it's quite trendy at the moment. I think it's something to do with Lord. I'm not really sure. Do, All do, I know do. about is I am Lord, 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 Lord. Do, do, do. Lord, Lord, Lord. Mm. She recognised me from the window. She told me to come inside, and she hid me. They had made the attic into a place where Hannah could play. There was a dollhouse. She hid me up there. No one else ever went into the attic. It was her place. Should we search about the attic as well at some point? What was the girl called? Uh, Florence. No, the girl she just mentioned. What, in here? Mm. She recognised me from the window. I don't think she... She did. She told me to come inside. She didn't she mention a name. They had made the attic into a place oh, where Hannah. I could play. Hannah. It was a dollhouse. No. Well, I guess that would she be whoever she is. That no would be her daughter or yeah. kid her or place. something. I don't know. Kid squid. There was something bad happened to Hannah. Maybe Simon killed Hannah and then she freaked out about it years later and accidentally killed him. There's lots of maybes. I've no idea. <laughs> We're just building up ridiculous stories. I think that's good. That's fun. Yeah. I think maybe... That's what the police do. Maybe Hannah did it. Maybe I Hannah got... I get the feeling Hannah's got... dead. Yeah, they did talk about... She did talk about her in the past tense. Yeah. She didn't talk about Hannah being there. Okay, so they, Hannah... They made it for Hannah. ...being dead, came back as a ghost, <laughs> murdered Simon. Oh my God, she's like, Ghost Stannis! Simon got posed in as the a doll's doll house. in the doll's house. <laughs> We're so good at this. We're amazing. Um, we don't need to tag this with anything, do we? No, just bananas woman talks more. <laughs> She's bananas. <laughs> She's not entirely sane. The legal stuff was completed very quickly. Hand me back in with Simon. Hannah's not dead. Eric took Simon the week off to help with the move. He decorated, modernised wallpaper curtains. Hannah insists the attic be left as it was, dollhouse and all. Simon never went up there. Who the fuck is Eric? Is she Hannah? Do we know her name at all? No. But. I really. I mean. Earlier on, she was talking about. The parents died and she inherited this place, so they moved into the house. And the doll's house was there and everything. And now she's saying Hannah and Siren moved in. Oh, and there yeah. was the doll's house. Maybe she had a, a break. 
A break. As in... You mean like, we out. were on a break! <laughs> no. It's getting all Ross and Rachel over it. No. Split personality. Yeah. As in some kind of mental break. Either she's she's two people and she doesn't realize, or she's delusional and she thinks that this other woman's life is her life. I don't know. We really haven't got a lot to go on for that, but it's not... But she's mentioned the same thing from two different perspectives. That's true. Unless but it she... happened twice, which would be very weird for them to individually inherit the same house. But that was from the same interview. I, I'm i pretty sure that... Let, let's keep this one for reference, because that's when she talks about I think about she Hannah. mentioned it in the one in the middle, and they're like 20 minutes apart. Mm. She recognised me from the No, window. it wasn't that one, okay. No, this is the one where she got she hit. She to come inside, yeah. and she hit me. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, look Woo! at those marvellous colours. Doesn't that just remind you of having a VHS? VCR, Yeah. It's the whole kind of having to tune volume it in. bar Oh, tuning. do you remember having to tune in your VCR? <laughs> yes. Now I feel old. Although at least in 1994 I was only three. <laughs> tuning in my VCR. Okay, let's... Maybe it was from yes. a different... I read a lot as a child and watched lots of TV men. It's kind of a fairy castle. No, this is just her introducing... Mm. Yes. Maybe it was from a different well, search. I inherited well. it from ah. my parents, so it made sense to move back. Yeah, know, okay, so it was a different interview. Yeah. Maybe... Felt like going back to old ways. Interesting. Should we save those two? Yeah, I we think we really should. I think they're reasonably important for us to come back to in case maybe they're not the same thing. Maybe she has a twin. Maybe it's one so of those three of them Mexican together. dramas where she has an evil twin sister that <laughs> murders everyone. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, I really wish that wouldn't happen. It, scrape, it scrapes on my table and makes an awful sound. Oh. Uh, I'll move closer. Hey. Hey there. Right. Um, where are we going? We're going for Eric? We're going for... We could find out who Eric is, I suppose, yeah. What other... Keywords are we looking who for? Hannah Should we is? write some of these down with a pen and paper? Do you mean like actually doing some proper police work? I feel compelled. We all know that the most important part of a police arsenal is a pen and paper. And a gun. No, because we're British, Jeff. <laughs> Alright, uh, shall I do the note taking? If then? anything, and a dog. Yeah, because dogs. police dogs are brilliant because they're all beautiful and they've but got a job. But you're not allowed to touch them. They get well. Yeah, usually, people, people don't just let me grab their dogs anyway, despite <laughs> the fact I really want to. It's creepy. <laughs> we've got Eric. We've got Eric. We've got Hannah. We've got Florence. There's Simon, who's dead, and her. Florence, Eve. Oh, and Eve. Yes. I think uh, Eve was a baby, but it's like a family name, so she might probably she go. She's a baby. So, may, uh, there was something else. Like a non-name word. Pregnancy. Pregnancy. And then the doll's house. Where we couldn't get the other three. She talking about stories and princesses. Should we just search princess? Princess. It's princess. Princess. <laughs> Oh, wow. That is... Oh, we've got a purple jacket this time. Cool. So when's this? 18th. This, this is even earlier. Super early. Well, cool. I might as well find out what she's talking the, about early on. Hit the jackpot with that. I really don't know how to get to the other entries, no, though. It's not like a scroll bar or anything. Specific. God damn it. 90s user interface. At least they've got drop shadow on it, <laughs> so it looks nice. I don't think people can see my mouse, but uh, that's not so important. Uh, Should we yeah. watch the video? <laughs> yes. There's an Amstrad one. Huh? Amstrad? It uses it for very much. There's a printer so you can write letters on it. Simon sometimes plays games. You know, try and tell, save the princess. That kind of thing. Stupid video games. They're so, so rubbish. She's got a pooter. She. She's got an Amstrad computer. She, at this point, would be, like, completely 
on on the cutting edge of computing technology. We had a computer in ninety four. Yeah, but Amstrad. Amstrad was pretty all right then, I think. Yeah. And they had those phones as well. Ooh, the Amstrad phone. I don't remember the phone. Oh, we did all the stuff. What? All the stuff that phones did before phones did got... Did it fax? Bit... Did it fax, though? Don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. But I know there's a big thing about Amstrad phones. <laughs> okay. I was three. I wasn't paying much attention. Can we search Amstrad at some point? <laughs> Why don't we search Amstrad now? We can come back to Princess in a minute. Amstrad is clearly very important. <laughs> Amstrad. I'm not going to do my Alan Michael Sugar impression. Balls. So I figured out the other day what Amstrad stands for. Uh, a mediocre, <laughs> <laughs> shitty technology running anal dicks. No! Amazingly, you'd have thought it would be that. Yeah. But it, it's Alan Michael Sugar trading. Bollocks it is. That's. I think yours is a bit more fun. <laughs> Go back to princesses. Oh, yeah. Stop staring at your Amstrad. No, I was trying to figure it out, and yeah, it's A-M-S trad. That's, that's a really bollocks name. <laughs> it's not great. It's not, it's not great, no. Right. More princesses. It wasn't the present so much. It was one of those arguments that had been simmering for a while. The present was a mirror. A nice mirror. Fitting with glass. The kind of mirror a princess would have in a story. He made it specially for me. She's I collecting wonder. cups. If the lady who recorded this. It's a cup conspiracy. Sorry. Did like a whole great big ream of it and they cut it up. Or she did them all individually. I don't know. I imagine it's a lot easier to remember the whole thing as a big long rant about princesses and dolls' houses and killing. Your I am husband. sure that somewhere on the internet there will be an interview with one of the creators, so uh, like going into how they made it. Okay, we'll have a look at that later. Yeah. Shall we move on to the next clip, which I think is a different top? The problem is she wears a lot of blue, but her hair's down. Okay, so that's the 25th of 6th, and that's the 1st. So, so it's a it... week later. Yeah. Does she have a tattoo? She's got that a That looks new. I do remember her, like, stroking her arms in... L look back at that one. This one. It wasn't the present so much. It was one of those... Well observed, Detective Matthews. I haven't even watched the video yet. I'm so good at this. She's got a tat. Maybe she joined a biker gang in the... Maybe she's already been to prison like and got a prison five, tattoo. Five days. <laughs> Maybe uh, she claimed it from the insurance money. She was like, I'm going to get all the tattoos I want. <laughs> <laughs> you can't stop me now, Simon. <laughs> um, People do crazy things. Yeah. We were 17. It was a nice wedding, people said. They really enjoyed the Simon tattoo part. Very handsome in the photos. His parents paid for everything, but he's an only child, so it was important to them. She killed him for the money. It was what they called a shotgun wedding. But if you looked at the photos, you couldn't tell. So she was preggers at 17. The dress was beautiful. Oh. It looked like Princess Diana's. <laughs> the chain wasn't quite as long. Princess Diana was horrible. There's a great photo of the bridesmaid helping to carry it out of the car. Did you just say Princess Diana was horrible? No, her dress was horrible. Uh, horrible. I'm sure she was a lovely lady. I never met her. But seriously, she looked like she was wearing about six meringues <laughs> and a huge, great big train. It's just everyone in the 90s thought it was amazing because it was very, very trendy then. Whereas now it's all about lace because of the recent royal wedding. Uh. I don't, having I don't. sisters with nice bottoms <laughs> that's what I took away from the royal wedding I bet I, I bet she took it away from the royal wedding as well oh, I'm pretty sure she takes it with her everywhere <laughs> she's um, quite fond of it it's nice so, to so is much of the country <laughs> yeah 
it's tying up all the bloody icons. It's been really annoying me, and Can I look just at the thought clock? to do it. I want to see if the clock actually tells the time. Because look, it's still 4.06.15. I think our clock is broken. It's also totally not a relevant time. Not that I match. The background looks like the background on the solitaire cards, though. Oh, it does. Cool. Oh, it's not the time, it's the date. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Oh. But it's not June the 16th. It's June the 28th. 27th. Today? Yeah. It must have been release day. No, it hasn't been out that long. It's only been out a couple of days. Oh, it might, might have been... No. I don't know. Whatever. It's, uh... The point <laughs> is, it's not five past four. No. Uh, so what's the database checker? I That's don't... how many files we've looked at in green, but one of them's missing. Right. It's probably her confession. <laughs> <laughs> so we can't find this. So we go immediately we search for I did it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ah! <laughs> okay. You got me. I'll confess. <laughs> <laughs>